Hey guys, World's Playground here. <clears throat> uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to get tight VNC uh, and VNC um, on your iPhone or iPod Touch and on your computer. Um, basically what this does is it allows you to display anything on your iPhone or iPod Touch onto your computer. Um, so before I get started, I just want to let you know that I'm giving away my iPhone. I already have a video up that has the description on how to win it and stuff. All you need to do is be a subscriber, leave a comment on my giveaway video. You need to put 3G dash and then what you want to say. Um, if you don't say anything instead of 3G, you only get put in once. If you say 3G and then give a reason why, you get put in twice. So better is your chances of winning. Um, <clears throat> if you've seen this video now, you probably still have time to go check out uh, that video and you'll you know just get it in time to still be put in the draw because I want to be doing this for at least another week. I'm really cheap. Alright, so um, now I'm going to show you tight VNC. Um, like I said, what it does is it allows you to display whatever you see on your iPhone, iPod Touch, on your computer, and you're even able to access. You're even able to access the iPhone, iPod Touch while using your computer by just clicking on the programs and stuff. So um, make your way over to my description. I will have a link to Tight VNC's website. Once you open up the website, it's actually their download page. You're going to be able to see um, Tight VNC Viewer. Just go ahead and download Viewer. That's all you need is the Tight VNC Viewer. Once you're done downloading it, um, I don't know if you need to extract any files or anything like that. For me, it just worked right away. But um, anyway, just go ahead and download it. If you need to extract it, go ahead and extract it. If you don't, and it's just accessible just from downloading it, then you're good. So go ahead, download it, save it to your computer. I prefer desktop myself. It's just easier to, to find. Now, after you download Viewer, go to your iPhone or iPod Touch. Go to Cydia. All right. Now, once you're in Cydia, go to Search, which is in the bottom right-hand corner of like the little five tabs you'll see at the bottom of Cydia. Click on search and type in V-E-E-N-C-Y. All right, now once you type that up, you it should come up. It should already be preloaded on your iPhone or iPod Touch. If you do not see it, you should go to the video which you'll be seeing right now, um, the all sources video. I will have a link as you'll be able to see right now to go to that video to get all sources. Now, like I said, if you're unable to see VNC or VEE, and see why right now just go to that video of all sources and then it should work then so now that you have VNC downloaded um, type VNC viewer downloaded this is all the steps you need to follow go on your iPhone or iPod touch click on the settings application All right. now once you've clicked on the settings application click on the Wi-Fi tab once you click on the Wi-Fi tab it will show you all of your Wi-Fi addresses that are available um, go ahead and click the blue arrow, which should be at the end of the Wi-Fi connection you're currently on. All right. Now, once you click that blue arrow, you'll see a whole bunch of new information, IP addresses and some other big long numbers and stuff. Just go ahead and memorize the IP address. That's all you need. The IP address, which is like ten numbers long and has like three decimals in between it, or uh, periods or whatever. So now, once you have that number memorized, make your way over to your computer. Um, once you type in, or sorry, once you uh, have saved tight VNC viewer to your computer you should be able to find it somewhere wh wherever you saved it go ahead and click on it open up tight VNC viewer the program as soon as you open it up a small new window will show up in the center of your desktop um, go ahead and type in your IP address in that little white uh, section where you're able to type things in it should say tight VNC server then you type in the IP address once you type in the IP address you click connect and then you'll see a new window in your top right hand corner of your desktop or sorry in the top left hand corner of your desktop saying like um, initiating or something like that and then it'll give you the IP address that which you typed in and then it's almost like loading once that happens you'll see a new window that pops up on your iPhone or iPod touch and then you just click accept and then you'll see right away how whatever is on your iPhone or iPod touch is being displayed on your uh, computer Alright you guys, so thank you for watching. Like I said, I am doing a giveaway for an iPhone or iPod Touch, or sorry, my iPhone 3G. 16 gigs, white background, great, everything. It's really good voted. It's jailbroken. I can unlock it for you if you want. Uh, anyway, so you guys, well, if you don't know what unlocking is, it allows you to use it on any cellular company. It doesn't matter if it's Rogers, Fido, Alliant, or whatever company support the iPhone. You can use anyone you want. You can use Telus, you can use uh, Kudo, or you know, other cellular companies. So you guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to check out my link to for the giveaway. You must be a subscriber. And um, I hope you guys, you know, good luck for the giveaway. So thanks for watching.